everyone, it's Olivia and Dion here for my Cast Up Thursday video. I know it's been a while, but um, my life has been kind of consumed by this play lately that I was costuming, and conveniently enough, she was the director of it. So I'm going to have her talk to you about what it was about and how long we've been working on it, because it's um, been kind of a long process. and. I had to costume 11 men, and most of them had at least two costumes. So, it was a lot to do. So, I'll let her talk about what the play was about and stuff. Uh, yeah, so the play is Bent by Martin Sherman, and it follows the journey of Max, who is a homosexual in Germany at the time of the Nazi rise to power. So, um, it's not a very happy story. <laughs> um, but there are scenes that take place in Berlin, um, and then eventually, by the end of the show, we end up being in a concentration camp. Um, but it's a really powerful story about love and humanity and dignity. Um, we just got it, the last performance was on Saturday night, and we have been working on it since I think November. A long process. A long process, but a good one. Yeah, I was I was happy with how all the costumes turned out. I emailed someone about getting some pictures so that I could um, stick some pictures in here for you to see, but of course they didn't get back to me yet. So yeah, eventually I'll have some pictures to show you guys of what um, we did, but I don't have them right now. Um, so when I do, I will include them. Uh, what I do have to show you this week. Is a non finished shawl that you may remember from a long time ago. I'll see if I can get closer. I don't know how well you can see it. Uh, I have the pattern with me actually. Oh, right there. Here it is. Okay, so the pattern is a paid for pattern on Ravelry and it is called the I Want You Shawl. Ooh, how appropriate for that. <laughs> so, um, you knit it out of a fingering weight, and there's three different sizes, I think. Or what the heck? So it says that there's a small and a medium, but there's not a large. So why would it be the medium? Why would it be a small and a large? Whatever. Anyway. <laughs> So it's a paid for pattern on Ravelry, and my friend purchased this yarn. Our friend Annika purchased this yarn. It's a mad tosh fingering weight. It's totally beautiful. I love all of the colors. I'll try to get closer again so you can. You probably really can't see the detail that well. So, um, so that's what it looks like a little bit. The colors and stuff. I think the colors are pretty true. But anyway, so the pattern. It's pretty easy to follow. I, I haven't had any trouble with it so far, but this is um, what the shawls look like when they're done. So, ah. Sorry, I'm so bad at telling if <laughs> you can see it on camera. Um, you see the pretty lace work at the bottom. So, let's see. I am finished with a few page, page, pages. Oh, I can't talk today. With a few pages worth of um, the pattern, but I still have a fair amount of way to go, and it's just such a slow knit because it's fingering weight, but it's going to be really beautiful when it's done, and I think the drape is going to be really great, so I'm excited to finish it and show it to you guys. Um, but yeah, so that's what I've been working on. I also knit a slipper that we were just talking about because I can't find it. Um, but it's somewhere in our house. I knit the slipper. I have a picture. I'll include it at the end. Out of this Noro yarn that I got for Christmas. And um, it's not done yet because I haven't felted it all the way. I threw it in the wash once and it kind of felt in it, but it didn't do it all the way. So I have to, um, I'm gonna have to do it again because it's not as thick a fabric as I want. So I'll have to do that again. And... Um, and it just looks a little weird. I'm going to be straight up with you. It's, I got this 
knitting book for Christmas called the Knitted Slipper Book, and I love the patterns in there, but it doesn't quite, I don't know, the fringe looks bad. Here, I'll grab the book quick. <coughs> Distract them with your beauty, yeah. Okay, <laughs> so this is what the book looks like, and I knit the... It's a paid for book, obviously. I got it for Christmas from my grandmother. But I knit this with this kind of rainbowy Noro yarn. And I finished one of them. But do you see how it has that fringe? My fringe looks horrible. It is awful. It looks really weird. It's not enough. But I put as many on as it said to. So, don't know what's going on with that, but hopefully I'll get that figured out. But, yeah, it's, um, I like a lot of the patterns in this book. So, if you ever wanted a good book for slipper patterns, um, this is another one that I thought was cute. But, it's hard to show you this without showing you the whole pattern. So, um, but yeah, if you're interested in this book, I would recommend it. it I got it for... 14 or 15 bucks on Amazon, you know, with Prime, I think, too. So that was pretty good. So, yeah, I hope you guys are all doing really well. I've been keeping up with your videos, even though I haven't put one up myself. And uh, I will talk to you again, hopefully, next week, and hopefully I'll have something done. So, bye.